office. I am Dr. Cap. Um, you knew that already, or else you wouldn't be here. But um, you said you were having some trouble with your uh, senses, so we're going to do another cranial nerve exam. I know we did one last week. Okay, that's fine. Um, if you're having trouble, you need to come back. You did the right thing by being here, and it's great to see your face again, if we're being honest. So, uh, that's that. Uh, I got my friend, Alberto, here today. He's going to oversee our exam and uh, provide you a little bit of comfort as well as me. It's always nice to have a fellow companion. Isn't that right, Alberto? A little guy. So, uh, we're going to go ahead and get started. Let's do the um, eyes first, why don't we? And I trust that you're seeing things okay you're not saying things okay okay well I have a uh, a few different items we can you know, pull out and have you test your eyes what I'll do first is um have you tell me if you can see the things I'm pulling out okay so first we need to get you some water I know that's important hang on one second little hydration check okay that might be the reason why you're having trouble seeing things is because you don't have enough H2O in your system your eyeballs might be dried out so here's this and that should be in med school and they were telling me uh, doctors are supposed to be professional and whatnot. So I went and got some hand tats because I'm a rebel. I also finished top of my class I'll have you know. Don't ever judge a book by its cover. Because if you're Coming in here with preconceived notions that doctors can't have hand tattoos or neck tattoos, I will sick out of that onto your neck, okay? Just mess with me. I would never do that. But enough about me. I don't mean to ramble. This is about you and your senses. So let's go ahead and get cranking on this bad boy, why don't we? Um, First off, can you tell me what color this is on this creepy ass mask? That's red, yeah. And what about this? No, that is not, uh, no, that's not orange. What color is this? Yep, yeah, just the fabric around black. No, it's not black. Okay. Um. How about this, uh, this washing detergent? What color is it? That would be, no, that's not orange. It's yellow. And, uh, top here. What color is this? It's not pink. No, it's that'd be green. That would be green. Uh, what about this here? White? No, that's red. I'm going to go ahead and... Uh, I'm going to go ahead and recommend you to an optometrist. going to check your eyes and stuff, but we'll continue this test just to further solidify your lack of being able to see colors. Uh, you might be colorblind, but that's okay. They got corrective lenses and stuff for that nowadays. So. What about 
got this? What color is this? Red. No, that's blue. That's blue. Uh, what about this little color here? Yeah. Uh, it's not orange. That's a. That's like a sea foam kind of aqua green blue color. Not orange. Definitely not orange. So. Uh, yeah. Tough. That's pretty tough there. Yeah. Uh, you're definitely colorblind. And one last test. What color is the liquid in this little cup? What color? What color is the liquid in this little cup? What color is that? What color is the liquid in this little cup? No, it's uh it's clear. It's definitely not brown. That's clear. Let me go ahead and check. Go ahead and take a look at the eyes. Pulling down your eyelid here. And you've got eyes. You've definitely got eyes. Pull it down your, your right lid here. Good. Pull it down that right lid. Okay. How many fingers am I holding up? Four. That's not six. How about now? Six. That's not four. That's definitely six. How about now? Five. There you go. You got that one right. Good job. Good job. Very good job. How about now? That would be two, not one. This would be one, but you see two here. How, how many fingers do you see now? Five, no, that's four. For science, how many do you see here? Six, so you're adding a finger that's not there. How many do you see now? You see two. Now you're subtracting a finger. Okay. Well, this really, this really is doesn't make much sense at all. Question. Did you hit your head? You didn't? Okay. You've been getting some sleep, though. Have you been getting some sleep? I hope you've been getting some sleep. That might be why you're sensitive. You see my fingers coming into your field of view here, okay? All right, here we go. Good. It's a good job. Good. 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 slow there. Good. Good, okay. Can you read the text here? What does this say? What does this say? No, that doesn't say Saturday. That says Energizer. What about this, this word here? That says exam. No, it says max. It definitely says max. This is this is the most peculiar thing I think I've ever witnessed in all my days of being a doctor. Very very interesting indeed. Well, it's just last week you were so in tune with your senses and now this week you've
completely gotten everything wrong, but we'll get there. Don't worry. Okay. What does this word say here? Can you can you read that? Can you read that? What does this say? Protect your friendships. No, it says protect your devices. We're gonna go ahead and move on to another test. Chalk this one up as a L, but it's okay. Like I said, I got an optometrist friend that can get those eyes working just right for you. We'll get to the bottom of it. Let's do our smell test now, okay? I like to do a uh, non-traditional smell test. I've got uh, my friend Roberto here. His name is Roberto. Roberto, 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 Roberto. He didn't get a bath last night. I bathed him. Um, so the little guy hates water. It was the cutest thing ever. But he, uh, he does have a smell. Okay, I used a specific kind of shampoo for rodents on Roberto. So he's gonna he's gonna carry a smell. What I need you to do, assuming you're not allergic to rats. Give my little man here a whiff, okay? So. He's a good dude. What does Roberto smell like? You need him a little closer? Okay. does not smell like tuna fish, but it does smell like lavender and honey, okay, and he's got feelings, so, watch it, rude, okay, let's go ahead and see if you can smell, I've got a, a series of smells, fragrances, I want to test and see if you can smell these a little better, okay. this smell like? Barbecue. No, no, it's not barbecue. That's uh, that's rose petal. How about this one? Shake it up real good. Asparagus, no. That's the smell of coffee. You're all out of whack, my friend. Let's give it one more try, though. What does this one smell like? Coffee? No, no, that's uh, definitely... It's definitely weed. Sticky, sticky. smell you can definitely identify the smell of it at most times but um should do it for that portion there now what we need to do is um test your sense of taste to see if you can taste things okay A series. I have a series. A series of fragrances. Three of them. And uh, I need you to just tell me what you taste. Um, 
I'm still just taken back that you said Roberto smells like tuna. That's, that wasn't very nice. I'll get over it. It might take some time, but I'll get over it. three of these, like I said. Let me know what the first one tastes like, okay? Just can I drip? Drip, drip, drip. What does that taste like? What does that taste like? Milk. No, it's not milk at all. That's uh, that's water. It's gosh damn speed racers outside. That was water. That was water. That was not milk. Let's try. Let's try this one. Vinegar? Mm -mm, no, that's um, just just sugar water. It's not vinegar. It's just sugar water. That's just sugar water. That is not vinegar. So uh, we got one more. We'll, we'll assume you're not gonna get it right, but we we're gonna try here. That's lemon. Good job. Okay. One for three. Still probably not consistent enough for us to call that a pass, so I'll forward you to a taste doctor. And uh, he'll get that figured out as well. So we got eye doctor and taste doctor on the books for you. Let's go ahead and move to the smell, too. almost forgot. Let's go ahead and move to the earring, hearing, earring, earring test and uh, the hearing test and see if you can hear okay. Okay, so I'm going to say a series of words from ear to ear, and you just let me know what word I'm saying when I say it. You'll just repeat back after me. Sound easy enough? Okay, let's try it. Formula One. Diddy Kong. That's not Diddy Kong. I said Formula One. pieces out of that pieces okay have you been understanding anything I've been talking to you about while you've been here at all anything at all nothing okay <laughs> all right you know okay how, how did you get here who brought you here today you drove okay Let's uh, let's just proceed. I'm gonna ask you a few more questions. You just let me know if you hear what I'm saying. This is this is concerning. Right. Police, police officer, gargoyle. Nope. Where? 
cord no not umbilical cording extension cord like a power cord okay let's do let's do the the, the feeling test now um and see if you can feel with your face okay This is uncomfortable for you, okay? Can you feel this? You let me know if you can feel this. I'm just kind of touching up under your jaw, your jaw here. You, you can't, you cannot feel any of this. Okay, how about, how about when I touch on your, on your cheeks, under your eyes? Can you feel any of that? You cannot feel that. Okay. Let me know if you can feel uh, if you can feel this. <laughs> okay, you can't feel that. Can you understand me at all? Bleep, blur, bleep, blur, bleep, blur, blur, bleep. Nope. Okay. Can you feel this? Touching on your forehead. Been tro you, you trolled me. You trolled me for the entire exam. You were just trolling me. Okay. I mean, it's not like me and Roberto don't have anything else to do today. Just sit here and waste time with you trolling me. Okay, that's cool. You won, Cap Zero. You're funny. You're a funny kid. All right. Well, since I know that you're just trolling me, last week you passed with flying colors. Um, I'll just trust that you were just here to see me. Um, but hey, I'm still taking insurance and exams and exams, so go ahead and see this receptionist up front, and uh, we'll get you billed. And that was funny. It wasn't funny. We'll see you next time, my friend. Love you much. I'll get over it. Have a good day. See you next time. Bye.